Okay, so today we are going to know um, some opposite words. The first one is polluted and the opposite of it is clean. As you see here in the picture, we have sewage, we have garbage on the beach and in the sea. So the area here is polluted, it's dirty. In the second one, there is no pollution, there is no sewage water, there is nothing dirty here. It's clean, okay? So polluted and clean have opposite meanings. Let us look to the word dangerous and safe. As you see here in the picture, it's unsafe to walk here. It's dangerous. We can't walk here. It's dangerous. However, in the second picture, it's safe to walk. Okay? Dangerous and safe have opposite meanings too. Let us look on the words beautiful and ugly. Beautiful, it's nice. It's a nice view here. We have a green plant, plant green trees. We have a clean area here. However, here in the second picture, we can see broken wood. We can see that the trees are bare. There is no leaves on them. Somehow the area here is ugly, okay? Let us move to the exercise one where we have uh, in the first picture a uh, river. What do we have in this river? There is garbage, a lot of garbage. So the water here is polluted. The water is polluted. The river is polluted. Let us look to number two. There's something broken here. Somehow the area here is ugly. Okay, it's ugly. The park is ugly. We look on the picture of number three. We can see broken wood. We have broken wood. Is it safe to walk here? No, it's dangerous. This is dangerous. Okay, let us move to the second one. As we can see that in number four, the river, this is the river. The river is clean. There is no dirty things. There is no sewage. There is no uh, rubbish. So the river is clean. Okay. In number five, as we can see that this park has a lot of trees. It's clean. Okay, so it's beautiful. The park is beautiful. As you can see in picture number six, there's nothing broken here and it's completely safe to stand in here. This is safe. So now we are going to talk about dolphins. Okay. So uh, this little girl is saying that dolphin dreams is the perfect holiday. We take people in our boats and we visit dolphins in the sea. You can swim with the beautiful dolphins. So here in the dolphin dreams, a place where, there, where we have dolphins, you can swim with the dolphins in the water. Do you know? Dolphins aren't dangerous. They are very friendly. They love playing people. They are not dangerous, so they are safe, okay? Dolphins can't breathe underwater, but they can stand underwater for about 15 minutes. They can't breathe underwater. Dolphins live in families. Dolphins have names. Their names are special sounds. As you know that dolphin makes some uh, special sounds. They use these sounds, okay? They use the sounds to call their friends and families. Dolphins can't live in polluted water. So here lies the problem. The dolphins cannot live in polluted water. They need clean water. Okay, but unfortunately the sea is polluted and what we must do is to clean and to clean the sea and make a safe place for the dolphins. 
Let us continue to the question. Read the text in the class book and write the true or false. Let us see which is true and what is the false statement. Number one, dolphins live in the sea. Yes, true, dolphins live in the sea. Number two, they like playing with people. Yes, true, they like playing with people. Number three, dolphins are dangerous. False. Dolphins are safe, okay? They are friendly. They can breathe underwater. False, dolphins cannot breathe underwater. Dolphins call other dolphins with the special sounds, true. They like living in clean water, yes, true. So here we're going to put the words in their suitable statement. So number one, dolphins aren't ugly. What's the opposite of ugly? It's a beautiful. Dolphins can't live in polluted water. They live in, they live in clean. They live in clean water. Dolphins are safe. They aren't dangerous. Dangerous is the opposite of safe. A lot of the sea isn't clean. It's polluted. Okay. 